Financial analysis notably deals with business's ability to handle difficulties, such as an economic recession, for example. Solvency translates as a business's capacity to meet its financial commitments. If a business ceases trading and the sale of its assets are insufficient to repay all its creditors, then it is considered to be insolvent as it owes more than it owns. The issue of solvency is therefore of crucial importance not only for the business itself but also for its partners, customers, suppliers and providers of capital. In an insolvent situation, the inability of the business to repay what it owes would cause losses for its creditors. In the detailed accounts presentation of the balance sheet, the permanent items appear at the top and the non-permanent items below. The same goes for the structure of a bank. At the higher levels, discussions deal with investment policies, with long-term commitments and businesses' financial strategies. These are senior management stages involving long-term balance sheet specialists. At the lower levels, further down in banks, as in the balance sheet, you find the branches, where all short-term day-to-day transactions are carried out on the spot, collecting checks, sales of treasury, CCAVs, etc. Here is the simplified balance sheet of a business. Question. What is the amount of its WCR and its working capital? Work out the amount of cash. WCR is equal to the difference between current uses of funds and current sources of funds. It is equal to the various types of stock plus customer receivable minus supply payables giving 450 of stock plus 400 minus 300 equaling 550. The working capital equals the excess of fixed sources of funds compared to fixed uses of funds. If therefore equals equity plus borrowings minus fixed assets which amounts to 600 plus 570 minus 800 which equals 370. Cash is equal to the difference between working capital and working capital requirement which is 370 minus 550 equaling minus 180. Question. Say whether the following statements are true or false. The WCR corresponds to an ongoing need for sources of funds. It is therefore preferable that it is financed by fixed sources of finance. Furthermore, financing WCR from cash undermines the financial strength of the business and makes it more vulnerable.